okay. I am very tired. Don't judge me. I've attempted this video before, but the other script was bad. So I'm doing it again. I mean, the script isn't that much better, but it... <laughs> Hiya, it's me again. I have a video script called Change that I wrote after my first video was released. It's about the fact that I'm about to go through a huge life change and how I think I'm going to handle that when it happens. It's a good short script, it's just a video that's gonna be there to document some of the beforehand feelings before I moved to university. And that's basically why this channel exists, right? It's so that I can document times in my life that I'll want to remember and look back on. That's why I tried to kickstart this channel now. I just turned 18 in June, but I'm not really an adult yet. So I wanted to document stuff from before. You know, what does my room look like? You know, what am I thinking and feeling? What media am I consuming? Who am I as a person? The problem with that though is I'm still hitting the same roadblocks that prevented me from doing this sooner because I'm still in the before. Now you may be wondering, what is the before? And I'll tell you, the before is kind of just how I'm feeling about my life right now and how I have been feeling about my life for a really long time. Ever since I've figured out what I want to do with my life, so since I was like 11 or 12, I felt like there's huge fundamental parts of my life that have just prevented me from having the life that I want and being the person I want to be. And because they're fundamental parts of my life, I can't change them. So things like being forced to go to school and study a bunch of subjects that I really could not give two shits about. Being surrounded by people who don't have the same interests as me and who really just don't get it. Not really being independent because I live with my parents. All of these things and a bunch of others are the reason why I'm not able to do stuff that I want to do in my life, including making these videos. I'd planned to make like five of these before going off to uni, but I'm only three weeks away from moving and this is only the second one. The reason why I call this time in my life the before is because in my mind, all of these problems will kind of just disappear when I go off to uni. And like, I know logically that that's not gonna be the case. I mean, there are going to be people at uni that I don't get along with. There's gonna be aspects of my course that I probably really don't like. I'm gonna have to still plan around other people because I'm gonna be living with 11 other people in my building, sharing one kitchen and one communal area. It's not gonna be perfect. And I'll probably need some time to adjust to it, honestly. But university is like the one thing I've been looking forward to my whole teenage years because everything about uni is what I've wanted my life to be for so long. I just love the idea of being in a class, learning about something I actually care about, surrounded by other people who also care about that thing. I've never had that. I've always been the odd one out. And in uni, I'll be the only one responsible for my life and what happens in it. Right now, this is before I can eat whatever I want, whenever I want. This is before I get to make music every day with a bunch of people who also care deeply about music for film and games. This is before I live next to a big city that'll open up a bunch of opportunities for me. This is before I get to meet a bunch of other queer people who are exactly like me, who I'll be able to speak to and actually feel like I belong somewhere. This is before I get to start living the life that I've always wanted to have. This is the before and I cannot wait to get out of it. This script was written like two hours ago, and I feel like now that I'm saying it all out loud, it's a little rushed at the end, but I don't care. So this is what you get. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that. Stay safe, people. <laughs>